This virus is about to descend on the state of Maryland like a tornado at night. It's going to tear through our state. I'm very pleased with what Governor Hogan has done to try to avoid uh, people being killed. But we have to realize after the tornado comes through, there's going to be enormous economic damage to the state. So those 175,000 businesses, I believe, deserve two things. Number one, we need to dip into the rainy day fund. Uh, early next week, free up $500 million from that fund that is designed specifically for this purpose. I'm talking every small business in the state should be eligible for a money grant from the state uh, to get over the next one, two, or three weeks so that they, in fact, uh, do not uh, go into bankruptcy. You should not have to pay your rental costs to your landlords, your bank loan costs, your fixed utility costs, your tax payments, all of that should be deferred until the emergency is over. We're doing that already with the taxes. We have told everybody that owes us taxes to keep that money in your pocket, use it for your, uh, hopefully your employees, if you're a small business, do not send it to us. You won't suffer any penalty, you won't suffer any fine. Once again, it's temporary so that once this virus has passed us, we actually have an economy.